Hey folks, how's it going? This is Paul from Neptune Systems. Today I wanted to do a quick tech tip on how to connect an Apex up to a new Wi-Fi network or how to re-establish a connection an Apex has to an existing Wi-Fi network. This may happen from time to time because possibly you have a new router in your home or your Apex is having some connectivity issues with your current network. With the Apex Fusion iOS app, it is an easy process to get connected back up to that network and get back to Apex Fusion. So let's get started. The first step in getting your Apex connected up to that new Wi-Fi network is putting the Apex into setup mode again. To do that, we're going to hold the reset button on the Apex for 10 seconds. The reset button is located just above the pH input and then with a tiny reset hole. I'm going to use something like a paper clip. You want to hold that reset button for 10 seconds. Wait till the status light turns blue and then release the reset button. Once our Apex has a blue status light, we're going to pull out our iOS device. This could be your phone or your iPad. You're going to open up the settings, you're going to select Wi-Fi, and you're going to connect to the Apex setup network. Once connected, we're going to swipe up from the bottom of the screen and now select our Apex Fusion app. First thing we want to do is we want to select Setup Wi-Fi. We're then going to enter the name of our reef. If you want to leave it what it currently is, like you like the name Apex or you already have your system name, leave this blank. Or you could enter in a new name with the amount of water volume. It's now going to scan our Wi-Fi networks that are available in the area. Once those Wi-Fi networks have been scanned, we're going to select the next work we want to connect to. In this situation, we're going to choose Apex Test. I'm going to click on Continue, and then I'm going to put in the password. You can always make sure that you entered the right thing by clicking on the little eyeball right there. Then you click on Finish Setup. You're now going to see your Apex reboot. Once the Apex has finished rebooting, it will reconnect to your Wi-Fi network. In another minute or two, you'll be able to access your Apex and Apex Fusion once again. If for some reason, after a minute or two, it turns back to a blue status light, that likely means that the password that you entered for your Wi-Fi network was incorrect. Go through this process again and double check that password. If you continue to experience issues, don't worry, Neptune Systems is here to help. Please reach out to our support team and we'll be happy to assist you. That's it, folks. That's all you need to do to connect your Apex up to a new Wi-Fi network. Thank you for choosing Neptune Systems, and thanks for joining me today on this tech tip.